Eric the Car Guy here for another quick tip. Uh, this one is a response to a question from ReadyMade777. Awesome video artist. Anyway, to answer your question about how do you know uh, when to replace those drums, well, this is how you know. Okay, now what you'll see here is this big ridge that was cut into the drum itself. And this was caused because the brake shoes got worn down to a point where they were contacting the rivets. These rivets are metal and what that did is that ate into this and cut this groove that you can see here. Now, if you noticed on the outside of the drum in the other video, you've got these measurements. Maximum diameter 7.2 7.929 inches, 201.4 millimeters. Now what that is, is that is the maximum amount of metal that can be taken out from the inside of this drum. So in other words, that is the inside diameter here. And if what you're gonna cut off, which like this ridge here, if what you're going to remove from the inside of this is greater than that number, then the drum needs to be discarded. So, to answer your question, that is how you know whether or not you need new drums or if you just need to machine them. But you want to try to avoid this because this was more expensive than just replacing these. I hope this information was useful to you. You can visit me at ericthecarguy.com and uh, stay dirty. See ya.